Hey Capricorn, welcome to the channel. This is a bonus love reading for you guys for the month of September. Remember to like and subscribe. So Capricorn, what we want to know is how your person is feeling about you. What's on their mind when it comes to you and what they're thinking about. And a card just fell on the floor. I'm going to take it. So you have the full. Well, 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 <laughs> Capricorn, there is somebody um, that is a fool over you, literally, <laughs> okay? Like, that's cool. Somebody um, is really feeling that they can start over in a good way, though, in a good way. You know, the fool is somebody who um, is looking for a fresh start. Maybe somebody who isn't afraid to face the unknown. Uh, maybe somebody who could be a little naive even at times. But this person, I feel, is uh, feeling like a fool um, over you. And hopefully that's in a good way, right? But nevertheless, they're ready to go on this adventure with you. You know, there's an energy of somebody being manic. <laughs> well, I feel that, like mania you know, or whatever, but somebody is, is almost like head over heels uh, for you. So let's see how you're feeling about them. So that ain't good. So we have the five of wands. So this is how you're feeling about this person and why? Like there could be some tension, you know, because the five of wands, you know, can indicate tension. So maybe you have some fears. I hope this isn't like conflicts and struggles and things like that. Uh, maybe you do have a manic person, you know, on your hands, Capricorn, because the fool, you know, can definitely uh, indicate, you know, mania. Maybe somebody who's a little cray cray, you know, that's that's a possibility, okay? But as far as how you're feeling about this person, like you legit, you got the, you got the, you got the like the, oh, that's the seven of wands, like golly. I think that makes it even worse. I don't know why I thought I saw the five of wands, but that's actually the seven of wands. So you feel, I don't know, maybe this person is a little crazy. You may have a, a, a little terrorist, you know, on your hands, Capricorn, because the seven of wands, those are boundaries, right? You know, this person, you know, could be a little challenging, you know, for you. And you may have to, you know, put your, your defenses up, you know, have your guard up, you know, maybe, you know, kind of, uh secure your territory you know so to speak so you could have somebody who was a little too adventurous uh in your life right now so you could have uh, a little lunatic so let's let's get some more messages um how do how does this person feel about you oh they feel good you know you have the six of um <clears throat> you have the six of wands so this person feels like they hit the damn near they hit the jackpot you know so to speak like they, they're walking around in this full energy and this six of wands energy like the world couldn't be better. Okay, so somebody's feeling good. You know, they feel like the universe just rewarded them with you Capricorn and they ready to move forward and make progress so that the two of you can be together. All right. So how about you? How do you feel about this person? Let's see how you feel about this person. Like, oh yeah, you feeling like you need to be prepared to fight. <laughs> okay. That's how I feel. I feel like, you know, you look at this person uh, as being, you know, a little on the spicy side, you know, a little bossy, you know, that's that's a little strong willed and, and things like that. So you could uh, be dealing uh, well, the fool is kind of indicates all signs, but you could be dealing with the fire sign because, you know, that queen of wands, you know, can be a little crazy. It's a very erratic in consuming, you know, energy, the wands, they represent fire. So you could be dealing with somebody who just might be a little too much. I mean, this person could be, you know, in that devil energy, you know, kind of like a little obsessed, a little overly attracted, you know, maybe a restless energy. Maybe this person doesn't sit still. Maybe they got a little ADHD, you know, or something like that. I don't know. They could even be a little on the bipolar side with all these daggone wands here right now. There's a lot of wands, you know, here. Okay. Yeah. I'm just saying. All right. So what else do we have for 
uh, Capricorn, what are some of the challenges between Capricorn and the person uh, on their mind today, Spirit? What are some of the challenges between uh, these two? Show me clearly. What are some challenges that may present themselves? Oh, hell, get away from this person. You got to go. Oh, shit. That's your challenge. Let it all go. <laughs> not like making you know pun out of this but i mean you got the tower card as your challenge i do feel like i don't know i just i, I, I kind of was like dang all right we got the fool coming in here we got somebody you know that wants to you know come out of their comfort zone and and love all over capricorn but this person might be a stalker okay you know or there's something off you know with this person you know you could be dealing with a fire sign and they could be a little cray cray you know like i said so the tower is here to let us know that there is a lot of chaos going on between you and somebody else lots of uncertainty like the tower brings a lot of uncertainty you don't know how this shit is going to end is the tower going to burn to the ground or is it going to <laughs> so are we just going to have some minor damage inside like the, the tower just doesn't you know uh reveal itself until the fire actually burns down but nevertheless it's a tower okay so something you know could be changing okay there's some type of breakdown uh either in communication or just overall uh in the relationship let's get one more because uh, you got ooh -wee. you know ran into the one the one <laughs> You might need to get a restraining order, you know, or something like, I don't know. So you got the sun. So, you know, this is nothing new. The sun is usually a happy card. So I'm not sure, you know, if the sun is here, you know, because it's trying to bring something, you know, to your attention because it does, you know, kind of illuminate, you know, things for you. Okay. And it does, you know, represent love, a strong love too, because you could have somebody here who really adores you right now, Capricorn, that's really, you know, in love with you, willing to uh, do whatever it is that you need them to do, you know, some, somebody that's willing to, you know, satisfy you at, at, by all means necessary, okay? You know, the sun can also represent achievement, again, clarity, you know, hope. So, you know, if you're going through something right now, if you're struggling with some type of psychopath right now, like the sun, you know, you know, is, is telling you to like keep your head up, okay? Things will definitely uh, get better, okay? <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna get another card because it. This is some. This is this is wow. You got three uh, major um, arcanas here. So <clears throat> let me see. You could be dealing with a Leo, which is a fire sign as well. So some of you could be dealing with a fire sign, but I don't think they in their right mind right now. So you might want to like not challenge them too much, Capricorn. I'm not sure about that. Okay. So we got the Hierophant. So this the you know this the Hierophant. Whew, sorry about that. The Hierophant, you know, is somebody who is like really looking for uh, solid relationships. It's all about, you know, truths, commitments, you know, also could represent, you know, source as well. So the Hierophant, you know, is showing up here because I feel that, you know, this person, you know, may want to take this, you know, on a, to a whole nother different level, like between uh, you and them. Hmm. What am I thinking? Yeah, this person wants, you know, the sun, the Hierophant, you know, they want this to, to, they want to grow with you. They're not, they're not looking at you, you know, like you're looking at them. You know, you look at them in the five of wands energy, like all this person is doing is causing conflict, tension, you know, and things like that. Man, I don't know. I feel like it could be, you know, a little struggle uh, between you and them, but you know, they don't look at you that way, Capricorn. They looking at you like you the you the you the sunshine of their day. And they feel like they want a high a stronger commitment with you. They're looking into the future while you may be looking at something completely different. But let's find out exactly what this is. So why is the fool here? Why don't we have the fool? This card wants to jump out. Um it had divine timing. Why is the fool here? All right, there we go. So this is like, you know, it could be the the, the um, third party. There could be some other influences here. You know, this person could have personality, you know, issues when it comes to third party with that full card. I do feel like there could be some issues mentally 
with this person is third party. It could be a literally third party or this person just could literally have some type of mental issue. So I don't know if they schizophrenic or, uh, and I know this is like really taking it out there, but I'm just telling you how I feel. But third party speaks of, um, you know, outside uh, interference. All right, so something could be interfering with this person's judgment. I can see that. I see that here. So we got barriers under under the seven of wands. So it just you know clarifies the cards. Like you you know really need to be mindful of this person. For some of you, I'm not trying to like freak you out. But, you know, keep your guard up because this person may be a challenge, you know, for you down the road. You know, I see this person as somebody who is like that, that really is just kind of out there, like a free spirit, loves adventures, really spontaneous, you know, not scared of anything, you know, just really ready. Like, let's just go have fun. And Capricorn on some real stuff, like I would be attracted, you know, to a person that has that kind of energy that just wants to get up and go and just run free and things like that. But, you know, and, and that's okay for a stable minded person. But I feel like part of this person's personality, like their, uh, their folly or the way that they play, you know, their venture and stuff in them may not all be sane. Okay, so with this barrier card, you know, clarifying the seven of wands here, I do feel that you may need to be um, mindful of this person. Like, you know, they, you may need to like um, pay attention to the signs. You know, if they seem a little territorial every now and then, then that explains a lot. But you may have to put some boundaries up with this person because they may be a challenge, okay? And you may have to call the cops, you know, with this hair font here. All right, so you may have to reach out to the authorities, you know, if this person, you know, has issues. So you got release here. So I don't know if this turns, you know, if this tower comes into play and things, you know, start to break down and you may have to let this person go. Just know you may have to release them, but oh, they'll be watching. So it may not be as easy um, to let this person go so if you're like in the beginning stages in a relationship with somebody like this be mindful okay be mindful all right what else for capricorn what else for capricorn this one to come out too so numbling so you know you could you know somebody here <laughs> may be having to recover you know from from this tower um somebody could be, you know, particularly if you got somebody that is just all over the place, you know, you may be having to find ways to distract yourself, you know, from this person, you know, rather spending some time alone, maybe having a swift drink real quick, a little smoky, smoky, you know, I don't know. But I do feel that with this numbling and this, you know, falling underneath this tower here, um, I feel that uh, there may be you know, a, a time where, I don't know if I say you're going to fear this person, but I feel that you're going to feel or fear or have the feeling, you know, like that something's going to guide you to leave this person alone uh, for whatever reason. You know, I feel like, and it's hard. Like I see this guy grabbing his head, like, like everything in you tells you, Capricorn, to leave this person alone, but it's because they're so energetic. They're so fun. They're so alive. But, you know, I just feel like something is telling you to be mindful or this person, something is just going to break down between you and somebody else. I do feel like with the sun here, you may be being guided to be mindful of this particular person. Okay, so let's see what else do we have here. Yeah, third party and the fool. Mm, that's that voice in the head. Okay, that third party is a voice. This isn't another person. It's that, that little... <laughs> This other stuff going on there. So you got forgiveness. So that's very interesting. So this, again, I do feel like this is like, you know, a struggle. Like this is going to be, it is hard. So if any of you are like, really like, I need to leave this alone. I really need to like make a move. You know, um, 
it's going to be a hard decision for you. I don't look at this as like an apology or you ask somebody to forgive you or them you. I just feel like this is the battle, you know, with you, you know, in yourself, like having to, you know, just you know, like know when something is bad for you, like, like with the sun here, like the universe is telling you like, this is bad for you, but just it's like, oh, forgive me, father, for I have sinned. I cannot leave this person alone. You know, that's the feeling that, you know, I'm getting out of this. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. So all fun and games now, Capricorn, but you know, you got received here later on, you know, you may be wishing that, you know, you left this person alone, that you cut off communication, you know, with this person, okay? Let's see. Let's get you a couple more cards and then we're going to get out of here. So we got um, understanding. So I, like, again, I feel like you do recognize this, you know, understanding, like, you do recognize that uh, there is something that's not right in the water. When it comes to this person, I feel like you've received the messages from source or you can feel it in your bones that this that, you know, just something ain't right. You know, I do feel that particularly with received and understanding like sitting side by side here, you know, you're going to have to, you know, if you can, if you're being guided to let something go and you continue on, then, you know, you're going to be having to forgive yourself. Nobody but you, you know, you might have to let this lunatic go. So you got go slow. So, you know, in this whole dynamic, go slow, right? This person is on steroids right now, but you need to go slow with this person because they may not have um, all their, uh, all the sandwiches for the picnic that they're inviting you to right now, okay? They could be missing some screws, okay? I told you, warning, yep. You know, this, this is a person who's very childlike, you know, very innocent, seeming but then got a flip side all right <laughs> they got a flip side yeah, i knew that yeah i feel that here okay so you're being guided away from this person before this tower comes in but i feel like right now you're just like oh i don't want to let it go it feels so good to me all right what else what else do we have here we got friendship there we go yeah 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 you might want to be this person's friend okay and don't let it progress past that. So if you haven't been in a sexual encounter with this person, Capricorn, maybe you shouldn't because I think that's just going to take it over the top. But that's just my recommendation. I'm not telling you what to do. But Capricorn, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.